Still with us, Hank? Yeah, my chest feels funny. Tachycardia. Your heart's beating too fast. We're sorting it out, but you stay with us, all right? Keep talking to us, Hank. Where's the hole? Ten units of insulin, sub-Q, and IV push D. It's still dropping. Why is this potassium up? Damn if I know. Can't sleep too. We gotta suck that potassium out of him. We gotta get his heart rate down. We need a crash cart. We got it. It's definitely not Addison's. It's not steroids either. Heart rate is 130 and rising like a Randy Johnson line drive. A for effort. There's no point in doing the transplant. Even if he was stable enough, it's obvious that we have no idea what's wrong with him. First it's too high, now it's too low. This heart's not responding to the atrophy. Heart rate's down to 40. I thought it was up. Now it's down. Last time he went out at 35. What's wrong? I have no idea. Hit him with the atropine before he gets to 35 a.m. We've already given him three milliliters. Apparently, that's not enough. He can't stabilize his heart rate. What did you do to him? KXLA. His pulse was through the roof. So is his potassium. He wouldn't do this. Something did. Call me when he's stable. We're dead. I remember the first time. You weren't even supposed to be pitching that day. I'd flown all the way to Tokyo to watch this kid, and he gets tossed for arguing a call in the first inning. <laughs> ah, your pitches. Perfect. Ball seemed to go faster than your arm. It was like the rules didn't apply, like physics couldn't slow you down. Ah, damn, it was beautiful. Hey, Warner. Hey, kid. How you feeling? I hurt. My arm, my head. Everywhere. They must have dialed down the morphine. That's just wrong, man. You're in pain. Hey. I got something for you. No. A doc in St. Louis gave them to me for migraine. I'm an addict. I, I can't take that. Even Lola was okay with the morphine. The stuff's just a little stronger. Come on. I'll just try one more. Three more symptoms. Heart rate up, heart rate down. Now he's hallucinating. You gotta promise not to tell Lola. Okay, coach. He's not just dreaming. No REM. He's actually awake. Drugs? Not psychedelics. Not with the heart symptoms. All hallucinations would point to digitalis. Would also mess up his heart. But he's not on it. And why would he take it? Yeah. Pithy analysis. I can see why they asked you to speak at the cancer dinner. I'm sorry, I'm gonna miss it. Sorry about the monster trucks. No, I think it's great. You're giving back. Only thing is... Uh, digitalis. It would only explain the later symptoms. Not the original ones. Sure, you know, it's got a lot of movement. Problem is, everybody sees the movement. You're throwing your curveball like you're, you're throwing a curveball. Deception, that's the... Same motion. Less movement, but it won't come back at you. How'd you get in here? I spoke Spanish. I told him I was the new shortstop from the Dominican. How's Hank doing? Lousy. Around your fingernails. That swelling is called clubbing. Hippocrates noticed that a lot of his friends who also had that tended to frequently grab their chests and die. Yeah, I got a heart condition. What's wrong with Hank? What do you take for it? 
Did you tell us? Got him with you. Right. That's weird. I just filled a subscription a couple of days ago. There's another bottle here. Don't bother. Hank Wiggins stole your pills. He tried to kill himself. No right. See, people remember how many they got. Dates right on the label, number of pills. Regular person can do the math. But a junkie doesn't have to. There's how many pills he's got left. That's all he's thinking about. But a big insurance policy. <laughs> this isn't about the money. <laughs> Not for you, no. Most reputable stores won't cash your checks after you're dead. But for Lola, well, girls like that, they're all about the money. Don't you say that? She already saved my life. I was dead in Japan and she brought me back. Everything since then, that's gravy. That's more than I deserve. You owe her everything. So the attempted suicide, the scaring her to death, that's, is that, that's gratitude, love? Yeah, I, I get that. We'll take out what you did to yourself yesterday. We're back to the kidneys and the bones. I'm scheduling the transplant. Never visit a patient. I want that baby. Even if I'm gone, that's a piece of me and Lola breathing, walking around town, going to baseball games. If there's any more transplant talk from you or Lola or anybody else, uh, I won't screw it up this time. I'll take myself out for good. I'll start treating the Edisons, which will most likely destroy what's left of your kidneys. Fine. Start the treatment. 